everyone, it's Sarah with RegisterNurseRN.com and in this video I'm going to go over how to use an AED on an infant. In my previous videos I went over how to use an AED on an adult and in this video I want to demonstrate how you would do that on an infant. However, before we begin I want to go over some key concepts with you. Now, the most preferred method to defibrillate an infant is to use a manual defibrillator. But sometimes that's not always the case. You don't always have the luxury of having that with you. And if you're out in a setting, the only thing you may have is an AED. So it's a very good idea that you get comfortable with the type of equipment that is around you because every AED is set up a little bit differently. Now it's recommended that whenever you use an AED on an infant that you use an AED with a pediatric attenuator, meaning that whenever you shock that infant that it will deliver a pediatric dose to the infant. And also you use pediatric pads and let me show you the difference. Here right here we have some pediatric pads. They are smaller than the adult pads. These pads can be used for a child and an infant. Now compare these with the adult pads. They are a lot larger. However, say that there's a situation, you get an AED, and the only thing that is available for you to use are adult pads, and it does not have, your AED does not have a pediatric attenuator. So you can give an adult dose to the infant using adult pads. The key is just not to overlap the pads, make sure that they're not touching. Now, how can you tell if an AED has a pediatric attenuator? Again, you wanna get comfortable with your equipment and make sure you know how it works. But generally, they'll have like a little key switch that's similar to what this looks like. And it's typically, sometimes it's pink, it may look like a little teddy bear. Um, just to signify to you that it's a pediatric dose. And then some AEDs have little switches on them where you could switch it over. So let me demonstrate for you how to place the pads and how to use the AED whenever you're using it on an infant. Okay, immediately whenever the AED arrives, you want to use it. So you will turn it on. Very first thing you'll do is turn it on. And it will tell you everything to do. And you'll want to start getting your pads out. and expose their chest and get out the pediatric pads if it has it. And the pads will tell you where to put the pads. And because this is an infant, we're gonna put a pad on the front and then we're gonna put a pad on the back. So let's do that. You're going to put it on the front and press it down firmly. And then as you turn the infant over, support their neck and flip them over. And then put it on their back. And then flip them over again. And you're going to plug your connector into your AED. Check connector and analyzing rhythm. And analyzing, do not touch the patient while it's analyzing because it could cause it to read something it doesn't have. Shock advice. Shock advice. So what we're going to do is make sure everyone's clear, stand clear. And whenever everyone's clear, you're going to hit the shock button, which is blinking. And Clear. Shock delivered. Begin five cycles of CPR. And then you're going to start your CPR bag. And you'll do five cycles. And after five cycles, this machine will reanalyze to see if we need another shock. And that beeping you're hearing is just telling you the rate that you need to go because we need to go hard and fast. So that is how you use an AED on an infant. Thank you so much for watching this video and be sure to check out my other CPR teaching tutorials so you'll be prepared for your CPR certification or recertification class and a playlist should be popping up so you can access those videos and don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel.